Hello everyone, my name is Beckett and welcome back to the channel. And today in Division 2, we're going to be tracking down our final hunter in Washington, D.C. and going after the ghost masks. Not only that, if this is your final hunter, you're also going to get that final ivory key for that nice named AR, the shield splinter. Now there is a couple things we have to do and we're going to go into that first. But before we get started, if you enjoy the content, hit that subscribe. And if you like the video, smash that like button. First off, I want to mention if you've been following following along with my hunter series or you've already took out the specter hunter you do not need to do the prerequisites you can just go ahead and skip down to the timestamp down below and you're going to be able to get him to spawn right away now if you haven't stick around and we're going to go through the whole process it's not too much but it is going to take a little bit of time so let's get into that all right first thing we're going to want to do is just make sure your global settings are changed down to normal since we're not really worried about the loot we're just going in there to kill a hunter get a mask get our ivory key so we can open up that ivory lockbox now once you're on your preferred difficulty we're going to want to take over a couple different control points we're going to want to take over the washington monument and the one directly next to it i believe it is called the flooded levy and it's pretty easy since we're going to be on normal go ahead and take those out that way we don't have to deal with any extra patrols while we are getting this hunter to spawn now once you've done all of that hopefully it is nighttime and you can go down into the supply room where you open up your cash for the washington monument control point and there's going to be a little console right below a tv screen now if it is nighttime you're going to be able to interact with that console and the tv screen will light up and it's going to show you a map of the washington monument area now it's going to light up three different locations at each location is a unmarked grave and you're going to have to use the salute emote on each one and when you know you've done it right your ui will kind of distort kind of like when a hunter is nearby and that's pretty much the game saying okay you've done this one right you can move to the next one so the first one we're going to head to is in the southwest area now if you just follow my waypoint it should put you directly on it it's just a mound of dirt and you'll see a little american flag stuck into the ground make sure you do that salute emote and then we're going to head to the next one which is directly opposite side of the washington monument in the northeast area now this one can be a little hard to find and i struggled with it at first just depending because it's nighttime and if the weather conditions are not that great you may have a little trouble but it's pretty much directly where my waypoint is so just follow that and you should have no trouble at all now the final one is going to be right on the flooded levy or right outside of it you've probably walked by it a million times and seen that mound of dirt but it is a grave site so just make sure you do that final one and you should get that final distortion now if it is still nighttime you're going to want to head back to the washington monument you can fast travel whatever it is it does not matter now at this point we are at a checkpoint so if you fail here you don't need to come back and do all the graves again you're going to be good to go what you're going to want to do is just head down to that supply cash room again and interact with the console one more time if it is still nighttime if it's not you're going to have to wait till the next day now once you've interact with the console again it will no longer show the map it will just show a black screen with a big orange circle now all you have to do is just climb out of the supply room and you're going to see a big red circle on the ground just walk in the center of it and you're going to hear that hunter spawn and the best thing i have to tell you is just move forward rush him you're going to be able to nuke this guy very quick he's not that much trouble and you're going to get your last mask for dc as well as the last ivory key if this was the last ivory key and then you're going to be able to head back to washington dc open that cache and get the shield splinterer now even if you get bad rolls on that gun don't worry it is now in your loot pool so you're going to be able to get it out in the open world anywhere you like to farm loot now that's all i have for this hunter video i hope you were able to get all your mask if you have any other questions tips comments put them all down there i always try to answer as many as i can and if you're looking for other videos i do build videos tutorials division 2 news everything for old players to new players and everything in between and thanks again for watching